I think the tennis horse challenge is really clever because for those who don't want to sort of run and sweat and cycle and swim, but really like shopping and want to raise money, it all made sense and the charity is a brilliant charity. I want to call them runners, but actually they're walkers, aren't they? So we've got to rally the walkers and make sure that they're really geared up to do their 10 stores challenge and uh, make sure they don't cheat. There's got to be no taxis today. We've got a range of experiences. Uh, so downstairs on the ground floor, we've got our fabulous scarf team doing scarf styling against um, a Liberty scarf selfie backdrop. Um, upstairs on the third floor in our heritage suite, we'll be offering a Prosecco to all the ladies and gentlemen. And then um, Joshua, our atelier on the third floor, are also offering complimentary blow dries and a fringe cutting, which is fabulous. Um, and all the ladies are going to go away with a, a nice sort of juicy goodie bag with um, another complimentary complimentary blow dry from Josh Wood. In store we've got a lovely experience for the ladies, we're giving um, manicures, um, goodie bags and also 10% of all proceeds today are being donated to Hope and Homes. It's been a fantastic day for Hope and Homes children today, the weather's been superb, the walkers have had such a good time, the retailers have done really well and we've raised loads of money for charity, it's a superb combination. That money's going to mean a great deal for the children we support, we're going to be able to deliver projects across nine countries, we're going to be able to prevent families from breaking down and for those children who are confined to institutions we're going to be able to reunite them with their families and support them to enjoy the love and the care of those families that they deserve.